Darika. Um, I'm so happy to be back here. I came here last year and I just loved it. So I'm back again. I So I landed in San Jose and then, so from London, San Jose. So I traveled down from Manchester, stayed in this tiny little box in Gatwick Airport. Like I didn't even know they had hotels in the airport, but it was just super easy. I checked out and just checked in my bag and it was so easy. Um, and then I went and had a Nando's breakfast. I didn't even know Nando's breakfast was a thing. It was so good, unreal. I had like some pancakes and hash browns. Um, so yeah, I landed in San Jose. It was a 10 hour flight, which was horrible. Um, I had like the worst headache on it. But then I stayed in San Jose for one night to recover, sleep well. And then I got on this tiny little plane. It was about a 50 minute, maybe 45 minute journey on this tiny plane. The view was insane. I really enjoyed that ride. So yeah, I landed in Tamarindo. And here I am. Last year, I traveled about Costa Rica. I stayed in San Jose for one night. Then I stayed in La Fortuna. There's a lot to do in La Fortuna. I did loads of activities, stayed there for five days. Um, I think it was like a three hour car ride from San Jose to Tamarindo. Not Tam Tamarindo, um, La Fortuna. And then it was maybe a three hour car ride to Tamarindo from La Fortuna. So you can drive round, which I did last year, but this year I just wanted to get there quick, so I got on a tiny plane. Um, but yeah, there's so much to do in Costa Rica. In this vlog, I'm going to be showing you what I get up to. I'm just going to be staying in Tamarindo this time. I'm also going to BPM Festival. Um, it was when it happened last year, which is why I was in Costa Rica, but then it ended up getting cancelled because of COVID. So, round two. <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna be going there tomorrow, I think it is, which I'm excited about. So when I was here last year, um, so it's easier to get about if you rent a car. So last year I rented a car, and every time I was on little road trips, there were sloths everywhere, all up in the trees. It was, oh my God, I just loved it, it was insane. So if you do come to Costa Rica, I would recommend renting out a car, because it's easier to get about. There are Ubers here, which are super cheap but I just think it's so much more fun. We can do a little road trip. got my <laughs> phone up I literally had to put my phone up to do my makeup but I hope it's all right I haven't worn this much makeup in a long time anyway I am heading to Dragonfly so this time last year I was in Costa Rica and I found this restaurant called Dragonfly and they do the best sushi ever it's literally the same standard as sexy fish it's so good so I'm really excited to go there and this is what I'm wearing I'm wearing like some long maxi backless dress my favorite um i just need to do my hair but yeah i'm gonna head there i'm probably gonna have like some sushi some steak i'm excited it's such good food <laughs> super jet lagged but I'm gonna go get some breakfast now at Waffle Monkey so I went here last year and they do the best waffles it's unreal it's like 
proper, I feel like a meatball when I eat it. It's like very, so much chocolate. Um, I think the one I got last time was um, strawberry Nutella and something else and like with whipped cream. I love it. I love my meatball food. So when I say meatball, I always call myself a meatball when I eat those like junk food. <laughs> So I'm excited to eat that. I'm going to go now. I might chill on the beach and I'm also going to get some juice. So I'm just going to film some of the streets in Costa Rica. Just so I can give you guys like an idea of what it looks like. Um, further down is like the main town. You've got all like the boutiques, more restaurants. Surfers. So this is where the juice place is. Up there is like a market with loads of food and it's just so beautiful. I just love the interior here. I love the money here, it's like monopoly money, it's so cool. So many cool pictures, little sloth. Love it. But like it doesn't even look like real money at all. Um, so I've just ordered a juice, I've got my hair it's so bad. I've just ordered a green juice and a ginger shot, just waiting for that, and then I'm going to head down to a Waffle Monkey and get a waffle. So I've just got myself a waffle. The beach is just down there, but I love this view. Um, I just got myself a chocolate Nutella and banana waffle. So good. Um, I wanted to get strawberry. However, they didn't have any strawberry, so I'm gonna go with banana, but I love this spot. It's so chill, it's so pretty. Oh my God, I feel like my GoPro's broken. Oh my God, my GoPro's broken. Okay, I'm gonna do like a taste test. I've had to put my hair up. My GoPro is like slightly broken, but mm. oh, that's so good. I just love being a little meatball. Ten out of ten. down to the beach and mate, look at this bird it's huge what is that what the hell is that I've never seen a bird like that it's so big but yeah I'm gonna go head to the beach now um, just walk around and then I need to have a shower because my hair is so greasy but yeah I'm just walking down this street so this is from Opoly. Um, I keep getting loads of DMs recently asking like where my bikini's from, that's in my vlog. So I'm gonna start saying where all my clothes are from. But this is from Opoly, it's super comfy. Um, so I've just been chilling in my apartment, getting some, oh that's really white, getting some work done and also editing some of my vlogs. Um, so I've been here for like maybe a few hours. Um, I think it's 2 p.m. now, I'm gonna go grab some lunch and then I'm gonna chill on the beach. I want to get some TikToks as well because I want to start posting TikToks of like what I'm getting up to, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to go somewhere and get some like, tacos. <laughs> Windy, and I'm looking for crabs or like little fish. 
So I've just found this stick. Do you think this is gonna hold my body weight if I sit down on this or is it gonna snap? put my glasses on because I look rough. Um, I feel like yesterday I was such a morning person and this morning I am not. I feel so dead, my throat hurts. Um, but yeah, the plan is to get some juice. I'm gonna go back to the same place, get some shots, um, some green juice, and then I'm gonna head to the gym before the rave day. So I'm going to BPM today, um, which I'm excited about. Um, I haven't drunk since like heavy junk since Bali, which was back in October. So I'm excited, but I'm scared. <laughs> but yeah, today I'm just gonna go to the gym, um, stock up on food, juice for tomorrow. And then yeah, I'm gonna get ready and go party. Just chilling in the bed. Um, I feel like I have not vlogged at all today. Um, I have been like super moody. Um, I woke up this morning just in like such a bad mood. I think it's because I'm just so jet lagged so tired uh, i've not really done much today so i've gone to the gym um what have i done went out for lunch came back home and had a nap <laughs> i'm just laying in bed now i've had a few drinks but i'm like i'm still so tired um but tonight i'm going to bpm festival i'm not wearing this i'm just in like some comfy dress i'm gonna be wearing a dress from ing I'd like this pink dress if you've seen my abifa vlog i wore it there I like to use dresses, reuse dresses over and over again. I, when I was younger, I used to always buy dresses, like new outfits for every single event. Whereas now I'm like, I will buy an outfit and I'll probably wear it like a hundred times <laughs> in probably like one month. Obviously not one month. Um, but yeah, I've not really done much today. I'm excited for the festival because it's the first day. Okay, so I woke up like an hour ago. My hair's a mess. I haven't brushed it, but I'm so hungry. I'm gonna head back to Waffle Monkey because waffles are amazing there. Um, I'm also gonna get a coffee and some juice. I was so hungover yesterday, I didn't film at all. So I haven't filmed since Friday night. Um, so I'm going to do like a recap of like what I got up to, how the rave was, but I need to get breakfast first. Okay, so I've just got back from breakfast. God, it is so hot outside. So hot and it's so windy. The last few days it's been so windy and it's extremely dusty here. Um, God, I don't know how to open this. So there's just sand, mud, dust just everywhere, going in my face. Um, it's like I was cleaning my ears yesterday and I had mud all in my ears. Like, even up here, it's fucking grim. Um, but yeah, it's oh, just so, so windy here, but I love the sun. It's good to um, get out of Manchester and just have a bit of sunshine because in Manchester it's so cloudy. I had to stop recording because I needed two hands to open the curtains. I think I've broken them. 
<laughs> they weren't fully open. Um, anyway, I didn't go to the Waffle Monkey because I completely forgot that this bakery, Seoul Bakery, do the best banana bread ever. So I went there and got a banana bread, um, almond croissant, which I've already eaten like half of it, but I've saved the best till last, some banana bread. Um, I also went to get some coffee and some juice from, I can't even remember where it was, but I'll like add it here. But I had like this iced coffee, it was all right. Um, it just tastes like chemicals. Like, you know when they put the syrup, the caramel syrup or vanilla syrup? To me, it tastes like plastic. So I was having this drink, this co iced coffee, and it was just like food. <laughs> I did not enjoy it. But I also got this passion fruit pineapple soda. So it's just basically like soda and at the bottom they put like passion fruit. Oh my God, it was so refreshing. It was unreal. I will um, add a little clip in. So good. I really want another one. <laughs> um, maybe tomorrow I'll go back. purple from the sunset um, love it but listen to all these birds so loud then you've got like a skate park here and normally like down there they do a market um, I haven't seen it this year but last year they had like markets that enclosed food smoothies and everything look how pink the sky is I left the beach too early it's always better when the sun's completely gone it's so pink. 